You want to hear another joke? Yeah. Okay, knock, knock. Who's there? Pizza. Pizza who? Can I have a pizza your sprinkle toast? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> ah, ha, ha. You know how I shoot this? How? Do you push a button? This button. Whoa, Batman. I watched The Dark Knight the other uh, weekend. It was very interesting. Do you know how we play Bumble Ball? I don't know how to play Bumble Ball. One teeth has to be just on one. Morning. Good morning, Arno. Good morning, Ellie. Good morning, ah. Bennett and Jack. Hello. Good morning. You know also how you play bumper ball if you're on the scooter? I did not bump know. the ball with your scooter on the front. Well, I don't have a scooter. Can I play if I have a foot? Because mm -hmm. Daddy did that. Gotcha. My, but it got to be one. Oh, Miss Erica has a kitty just like ours. Hey, all you cool cats and kittens. Hi. That was a really good That's the parents who are joining us today. <laughs> Thank 
Can you do that again? It's the last. It's near the last. Is it the last day of the month? It is the end of our rainbow curriculum. I'm so sad to see the month go. We maybe didn't get to uh, do too much of it in class, but I do have a really fun book today to celebrate colors. It also includes a dog, which I know some of you have. And it also involves some counting, and hopefully you guys know how to count up to 10. So that's what we're gonna practice today. Turn on your listening ears. Check, check, check. Oh, uh, they're all listening. Here we go. Dog's colorful day. This is dog. As you can see, dog is white with a black spot on his left ear. At breakfast time, dog sits under the table, as usual. Splat! A drip of red jam lands on his back. Now dog has one, two spots. After breakfast, dog runs outside. He slips past the man, painting the front door. Splish! His tail dips into the blue paint. Now dog has three spots. One, two, three. Dog runs to the park and rolls on the grass. Squash! The grass makes a green stain on his white coat. Now Dog has one, two, three, four spots. Up follows a little boy eating chocolate. Mmm! Squish! The boy gives Dog a chocolatey pat, but no chocolate. Now Dog has five spots. A bee buzzes up to see what's going on. Swish! The bee drops a yellow pollen as it flies by. Now Dog has six spots. Dog trots on through the park. Splosh! A drop of pink ice cream lands on his right ear. Now Dog has seven spots. Time to go home. Dog runs up the, sc runs up the street. Splash! A bouncy ball splatters Dog with gray mud. Now Dog has eight spots. In front of the gate, Dog steps on a carton of orange juice. Splurt! A patch of orange appears on his leg. Now Dog has nine spots. Dog races back inside and knocks right into Vicky. Silly Dog! Vicky's purple marker lives a smudge on Dog's head. Now Dog has ten spots. Vicky looks down at Dog. She counts his colorful spots. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten. Vicky looks more closely. Dog has a red spot of jam, a blue bob of blob of paint, a green stain of grass, a brown smear of chocolate, a yellow patch of pollen, a pink drop of ice cream, a gray splatter of mud, an orange splash of juice, and of course, a black spot on his left ear, a purple smudge of ink. You need a bath, dog. When Dog climbs into bed, he has just one black spot on his left ear. <sighs> Good night, Dog. What a colorful day you had. That was a colorful day. Have you noticed that sometimes when you go about your day, sometimes colors get on your things? It happens. That's why we got to clean ourselves, and that's why we've got to take baths and shower. Now I'm going to need everyone's help for this part. Mm, let's do that. And like this. Okay. All right. I'm going to need everyone's help for the weather report. I'm going to unmute everyone so I can hear your beautiful voice. Oh, I hear them. There you are. All right. With love. Oh. What's the weather? 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 What's the we
someone that you want to communicate with that can't hear you so well. That could be an older family member, that could be someone who's deaf, and they need your help to speak to each other. So we're going to learn a little sign language. It is super simple. We're going to start off with hi. And this works. This might be something more like hey. But if you want to say hi, you take your hand and slide it from your head. Hey. Now, if you wanted to say, what's up? Like, how are you? Take your middle fingers, put them on your chest, and kind of throw them out. What's up? Hey, what's up? Now, let's say you wanted to say, my name is, because that's how you usually like to greet yourself, right? Or greet each other, right? Is, hi, what's up? My name is. So, for my, 
you just put your hand on your chest. My, you can go like this, my. This is super simple, name. Two fingers over each other, name. My name is, and then this is where you spell your name. So my name is Erica, and I would spell with the alphabet. So, oh, Frey's coming to join us for a sign time. Show us your paws. So, for spelling my name, I have an E, R, I, C, A. Those are the parts for my name. You have different letters in your name. I would like for you to go home, or you're already there. <laughs> I would like for you, while you're at home, find those signs that match the letters in your name. Not only will you learn how to spell your name, and if you're already really good at spelling your name, then it's simple. You're learning how to sign your name with just your hands, not speaking. It's a new trick. So I want everyone to try it. I'm gonna ask everyone to join me for this part. Um, gonna go into gallery view, and let's all try together. So while we're all muted, because remember, we don't really need to hear each other for this. All right, let's see if everyone can say hello using sign language. Hello. All right, now you're gonna say what's up. What's up? Pretty simple, huh? Okay, last one, my name is. So my name is, and then, so there's no, there's no sign for is. And then you spell your name, this person's already got it. I'm still learning mine. E-R-I-C-A. You guys have to go learn the letters in your name. It's super simple and anybody can do it. You can even teach sign language to babies. Do you have a baby in your house? You guys can go learn sign language together and you can talk to your baby. It's amazing. All right, and then We'll, we'll be learning some more sign language as we go along. So make sure you tune in and then you're gonna learn a whole nother language. <gasps> mystery box, hey, 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 mystery box. Whoa, mystery box, yeah, mystery box. I'm gonna unmute everyone. I like to hear what you think is inside your mind. And all right, for the mystery box today, number one. What color do you get? Yeah, you get blue and yellow. What color do you get? What do you get? Here's your hint. This color is behind me. Yeah. Green. It's green. Who got that one? You guys got that one? Oh my, oh my. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Next, we have. Okay, thank you. Ooh, this one's okay. Thank you. I have two colors in this box. Thank you. What two colors do you need to make? What two colors do you need to make? Some of you guys have these colors on. Red. I, I heard it. it. Blue and red. Woohoo! Purple. Maybe you can find us. Can we make purple in here? Kind of. Okay. This one is for friends who know their letter sound. All of you. Ha. 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 All right, Anna and Elsa have one of these. Yeah. It goes really fast and it has hooks. Uh, not a moose, but a horse. It's a horse. horse. It's a horse. We got a horse. Elsa, <laughs> sorry. Has the letter O. Let's think of what O. A lamp. Lion. Light. A lollipop. Any other ideas? Oh, a lollipop. Miss Chris, and it's not a good one. A lion. A lollipop. Oh, I forgot to give them a hint. It's a lemon. It's a lemon. Oh, there's so many L 
things I could have had in there. That was tricky. I'm getting tricky. All right. This one I'll give a hint for. It starts with a U. U. Like, yes. Yo, yo. No. Oh, oh, you are definitely going to need this. Oh, yeah. uh, this character is in Star Wars and it's a movie. And he is a lightsaber, but he's nice. He's a little funny. Yoda! Yoda! Did you go Everybody's participating, participating <laughs> for your actual assignment. If you guys could spell your name and silence it, I would really love to be able to see you can have to spell your name. Get it! 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 Get it!